very specific uh, area, uh, not only uh, as the nature, but uh, also as, with the social and economical uh, space. Uh, as I uh, presented an Othello Gallery, but now you see Armatorka Ustí nad Labem, because uh, two years ago we enlarged our activities and uh, expand. Uh, so we uh, not, I'm not only uh, not representing only an Othello Gallery, but all the complex of the building uh, Armaturka in Ustí nad Labem. It's a uh, industrial building in the uh, very specific uh, quarter of uh, the town in the periphery. Uh, where it's a uh, very uh, specific uh, and uh, destroying uh, urban and social uh, area here. So uh, it is very important for us and for our art and activities we do. Uh, but the history of the Amalfella Gallery is a little bit uh, longer. Uh, it takes more than uh, 20 years but don't be afraid, I will be shortly. Uh, and also like a gallery, as, uh, um, as the space uh, for the contemporary art was established in 1992 uh, on the base of a former uh, communistic gallery. Uh, we took the name of the gallery, uh, from created uh, something like a foundation for art, and uh, try uh, to uh, realize uh, the, this space uh, as a space for uh, presentation of contemporary visual art. Uh, the former space was not in the, uh, in the industrial building, it was uh, right in the center of the city, it, it was smaller than we have now. Uh, uh, in the 90s, uh, the Anantala Gallery was uh, uh, connected with the Faculty of Art and Design, uh, which was uh, established in the 90s and uh, with the name of the first uh, uh, head, uh, first uh, director of Anantala Gallery, uh, and his name, I think, I guess, uh, he, uh, his name is known here, uh, it's Michal Kolacek. Uh, now he is uh, uh, my co-curator and uh, he's a former dean of Faculty of Art and Design. So uh, the, the 90s of the gallery, uh, of Amelfella Gallery, is uh, connected with the uh, presentation of contemporary art uh, from the Czech Republic and of, uh, from the post-communism countries. Uh, we were focused on periphery art centers uh, and local scenes, uh, but not only uh, in the local area, but uh, we start to, uh, to create something like an international context. Uh, what about the structure, uh, how we function now? Uh, we are a non-governmental organization it's not a foundation now, it's a something like a public uh, company. We are uh, non-commercial. Uh, uh, for, for the structure, uh, there is one director uh, and one uh, assistant, and uh, our, um, our uh, work is uh, focused on volunteers or freelance curators, activities, and, and so. And when we are connected uh, with the Faculty of Art and Design, so, uh, we all, uh, always or uh, often uh, use the uh, voluntarity of uh, the employees of the Faculty of Art and Design. Uh, our important activities is uh, presentation of actual and contemporary art. I didn't uh, choose uh, pictures of the exhibitions, but uh, we bring some publication, and if you want to see detailed uh, our exhibition, so uh, you can come to me and I will show you uh, the publications because uh, I think it's uh, better to, to, to see something more than uh, one picture for, for, the, uh, for the exhibition. Uh, but uh, the, because the actual contemporary art is uh, so uh, wide, uh, wide theme, so we are focusing uh, 
more for the social engaged project or for the political uh, and we are uh, focused on communication and participatory art project. Uh, it's, uh, it's logical because uh, uh, when we are situated in a, a city uh, and area uh, which is destroyed uh, during the uh, or after uh, the communism uh, era uh, and uh, connected with the, with the hard uh, restructur restructurization. So the social theme is our uh, uh, more important for us. Uh, but uh, uh, for us it's uh, more uh, important the accompanying program. Uh, it means the edu educational program because when we uh, work with uh, the project of the contemporary art, uh, very hot and very special, uh, it uh, takes uh, uh, many problems or uh, misunderstanding with the audience or with the viewers. So we are uh, focusing on accompanying program like uh, uh, like um, uh, programs for uh, schools and and so I will speak about it. So, but uh, some some pictures uh, about the per uh, participation art, which is uh, for us very important, uh, like. Uh, uh, something what the what is uh, um, initiative and uh, communication uh, between uh, art and uh, other space. Uh, we are uh, not only uh, situated in the gallery, but we often uh, do the public space projects uh, from the 90s. Uh, it is our uh, most interested uh, theme in the Ustina Laban. And Amalfila Gallery was often the initiator of the public space uh, project, uh, not only in the local scene but in the uh, uh, international uh, range of view. Uh, about the cooperation, uh, in the Czech Republic we cooperate with uh, many organizations and many institutions, uh, for example, Brno House of Art. Many galleries in Prague, Czeska Budiewice or Poznań. Uh, in Germany, that Zuzana mentioned, he, uh, we often uh, work with Dresden because it's uh, uh, from Usti, it's near to Dresden than to Prague. So it's, it's uh, logical. Uh, with Austria, we uh, uh, cooperate often with uh, con uh, Rotor Contemporary uh, Association of, for Contemporary Art in Graz. Uh, and so from the 90s, uh, when we were focused on the uh, uh, cooperation with the post-communism uh, countries, uh, we uh, uh, cooperate with uh, Dubrovnik, Zagreb, Ljubljana, or, or something like that. So uh, the, the Central European art is a really important uh, range of view for uh, Rotor Gallery. Uh, on, on this small picture, you can see the uh, the typical uh, view, a typical uh, picture from from the area uh, where is uh, gallery situated. It's it's really a, a social uh, ghetto, so this is very important. Uh, as I uh, mentioned on my uh, beginning of my speech, uh, uh, Amalfila Gallery is located uh, in the second floor of the industrial building. Uh, but uh, two years ago, we uh, expanded on the first floor uh, of the Armaturka, and uh, with the uh, cooperation with the Faculty of Art and Design, we open here uh, more workshop spaces. There are some. Uh, workshops, uh, residencies, uh, and small ex exhibition spaces, uh, which are run uh, through uh, artists or uh, students, and uh, it's more uh, more living space, more uh, space for uh, for the practical, not only for the presentation, but uh, it's a space for uh, discussions, lectures. Uh, uh, and many, many activities which are more uh, focusing on uh, audience and uh, for the communications uh, than uh, just the pure presentation of art. So we have a coffee room with a library uh, where are uh, different uh, 
activities uh, realized uh, so other spaces. So residency, uh, we do international uh, workshops for, for the graphic design. Yeah, because uh, the Armaturka workshop space is more focused on the design and not only for the, uh, for the fine art. Uh, along the accompanying programs, which are uh, very important for us, uh, as I uh, told, uh, for, for the communication level, we do uh, guided tours with lector, curator or artist, uh, we do practical workshops for, for students and uh, for, young, uh, for young people, and so we do educational programs. Uh, this is the, our uh, making connection with the university. Uh, where are uh, many students which are interesting in it. So, and uh, maybe we, uh, when we have some, or, or we see the, the problematic uh, way uh, with the audience, so we try to, um, uh, so we try to educate the, the, the young children uh, and uh, to be our future audience. Uh, so now you can see the, the industrial space of uh, our gallery. Uh, this is the educational workshop. And uh, about the financing and maybe uh, more about our independency or maybe the dependency. Uh, it means uh, we are financing from uh, uh, multi-sourcing. Uh, our uh, and now I am speak uh, mainly about the Amalfa Gallery. Uh, we get grants from Ministry of Culture, uh, City uh, Council of Usti, and small uh, regional institution. We have some own sources, but a little bit, uh, a little bit smaller. And our uh, great support is uh, from the Faculty of Art and Design. Uh, and it is because uh, of their ability to get uh, something like a support from uh, European Union, uh, because our organization is not able to uh, to get it. So about problems, ideas, and solutions, uh, uh, our big problem is the unstable budget because. Uh, we, uh, but I think you know it, uh, we always wait uh, at the beginning of the year uh, how the year will be. So uh, I think uh, our uh, something like a wish to uh, other years is to, to have a stable budget. Uh, this is uh, other problems uh, because we are in the industrial old factory uh, building. So uh, our problem is uh, how to invest to reconstruction of the gallery because sometimes it's needed. Uh, um, it's not a problem, the third one, but it's a maybe idea or maybe, uh, maybe the solution to it's a communication with audience and better the communication with the city council, but not only for the money, but uh, for the uh, something like that, that to present and educate uh, the visual art is uh, what we need in the city, like a, uh, like a level of culture and uh, in the Ustina Labe, uh, the city with a problematic uh, social uh, level is this uh, very uh, important. I think from me it's uh, all and thank you for attention.